Yo, what's happening guys? Welcome back to another episode of the Void Hero Map. If you guys have missed out on any episodes, like always, you can go back, check out a playlist, get yourself caught up on ones you have not yet seen. As for today, we have to add a couple of people here to the garden. So first of all, we're going to go ahead and we're going to add... We're going to add Sir Wolfwoods to the comment garden. He dropped a comment on my Red Dead Redemption 2 video. So that is something I live stream on Fridays. If you'd like to check that out, you can definitely uh, pop over when I'm live or I upload the videos later also. But uh, he just said, oh, I love this game. How are you enjoying it? And uh, much appreciated for the comment, Sir Wolfwoods. He's also a... Uh, stream viewer and i watch a lot of his streams and stuff he's also a live streamer so you can check him out on the twitch and also the youtubes but uh anyways let's go ahead and throw his name on in sir wolf woods thank you for the comment and for watching streams and stuff like that much appreciated and welcome to the comment garden next up let's go ahead oh we need to add another space here let's go ahead and um move that out let's go ahead and add another sign here Got a lot of members popping off. Thanks to uh, Ross. He dropped a, a lot of gifted memberships. Much appreciated, buddy. So today, we are going to be adding Joel Smith. Much appreciated. Thanks for being a member. And welcome to the member zone. So if you would like to become a member also, it is only 99 cents to do so. And that will get you a bunch of cool perks. You will get access to a 24-7 cross-platform vanilla Minecraft server that you can join when you want or with me on Fridays. I'm going to start streaming that again very soon because Minecraft 1.21 is going to be coming out. We're going to be starting Season 3 of the Minecraft Member SMP with a whole bunch of new stuff. All kinds of uh, warps, teleports and claim zones maybe a combat zone we shall see lots of lots of cool stuff coming and uh as well as that you also get emojis you can use in chat whenever i'm live or even on videos you get videos early so whenever i upload them sometimes a day early you will get to see them as soon as they're uploaded and not when they come out for everybody else all of that good stuff but uh, anyways on to the episode we have things to do today uh so today what the plan is I need to make some torches. I need to get some wood, actually. I was kind of AFK a little bit to get, let my bamboo get up. But uh, today what we need to do is we need to throw a little bit more nether stuff. So I have more bastion fragments. We're going to pop off with some more um, bastion area and check around to see if we get a fragment for the ancient city. We're also going to throw another fortress fragment, and we're going to search around that, see if we can get anything good out of that. Because I'm believing that those two are going to be where I'm going to end up getting the ancient city fragment. One of those two. I just ran outside to get wood and then forgot to get wood and went back into my house. <laughs> that is uh, fantastic. But anyways, yeah, I need to get some of this stuff. You know what I bet's happening? I bet an animal's getting up in there. Or something is a slime, maybe? Because this thing's running fine. It's always running fine. Somehow something gets in there and stops it, I think. So let's make a whole lot of wood. Because we're probably going to need to build out some platforms, right? We can also make some sticks. I might as well do... Is it three of those or is it two of those? There we go, make some sticks. Oh, we had some wood in there already also. We got a lot of bamboo. We're kind of popping off in the bamboo department. Uh, we need to make some torches. So that way I can kind of safety up the areas I'm going to be going into. We got a lot of blocks. Um, we can also always make some more torches also. Keep that on me. Uh, I need some golden boots. I'm actually going to have to craft myself up some golden boots. I've been kind of lucky. I've been surviving on just the boots that I've had so far. We have a fortress fragment. We have five bastion fragments, so we should uh, we should get pretty lucky with that, hopefully. And I think we may find more fortress fragments in some of the bastions, so that could be good. So I'm going to throw my, my booties on. I may need to repair some of my armor also while we're at it. You know, my leggings just have unbreaking two. Maybe I should try an enchantment on that. Also, my netherite boots also just have unbreaking two. Let's see something here. Unbreaking three, we can get on some uh, golden boots. Is that going to be worth it? I just don't know. But yeah, at some point, I'll probably have to repair this stuff up. They're kind of getting a little bit beat. Maybe I'll uh, level up a bit and get some more enchantment. It's kind of off-camera stuff, I feel like. The uh, the nice thing is, even if I end up dying, I don't end up losing those levels. So that is that is pretty handy. That's uh, very nice of the map creator, like I've said before. <laughs> but uh, yeah, let's pop off. Let's head to this nether zone, and let's throw some more fragments. So ultimately, we need to get to the ancient city to get some of those echo shards because the crafting recipe for eye of enders has changed it's um blaze powder 
or no, it's um, Prismarine Shard, which I also, I need to figure out how to get more of that. Because I actually, I think I only have one at the moment, and I do need more of them. Also, like, while I'm at it, I might want to just clear up this area a little bit. This has kind of been a mess for a while. And, like, this is my main walkway through here, so, like, I should probably keep this kind of clean, right? I walk through here all the time. All right, I'm heading on up to the Bastion Zone. First, I think we're going to throw a Bastion Fragment, and then after that, we'll try the uh, Fortress Fragment. They have a lot more Bastion Fragments, so I feel like we should, uh, you know, throw some of those. See if we get more Fortress Fragments, because it might be good to throw multiple Fortress Fragments at this point. We shall see. So this one did need to be thrown high up, right? That's why I built all the way up to here. Let me see. Uh, Y70. So we are at Y69.87. What? Oh, uh, oh, 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 oh. I was that, that, that's lower down. I was like, what? How do you get the point eight, whatever the frig that was? So what I think I'm gonna do, I'm gonna build up a little bit of a spot here, a little stopper, a do hicker. You know what I'm saying? We're gonna take one of these. And we're going to throw it into that stopper, and we'll see what happens here. Hopefully not bad things. All right, let's go. And, of course, it's getting dark. Oh, no. Bad things happened. I guess you don't want to stop it. You want to let it roll. Fudge. It just wasted one. So um, let's try that again, but this time let's not stop it. Let's just, let's just see what happens. What the fudge? I think you want it to fall off the edge. I'm just wasting these. I just wasted two of them. God dang it. Like, I think you want it to go far. Whoa! How did that just happen? You know, I think that's probably a problem. The fact that I keep um, falling into the void, I think that's causing my armor to break. Because I think my armor takes hits from me taking hits from falling into the void. Is that is that actually something that happens? Do you actually take... Does the void hurt your, um, your armor? I'll have to look into that. But anyways, we have slept. It is daytime. We can go back and we can explore... Why are you not getting frigged up? It is daytime, my friend. You know, something I always do is like kind of just walking off the edge of this. So I'm going to kind of like, as we're going here, I'm going to try and improve this a little bit. So that way I don't walk off the edge so much. I get like so distracted. Like I'm just talking and running and all of a sudden I'm off to one side and I can just walk right off the edge. So we're going to like double wide this. Why did that guy just fall from? Where did he fall from? I mean, <laughs> why did he fall from? Uh, that makes no sense. Where did he fall from? I seen a bunch of piglins falling with me also, like whenever that Bastion spawned in. So I don't know what the fudge happened there. Also this, like I said, I need to maybe improve my path a little bit. I got bad pathing here to get to where I'm like going. I'm going here all the time. You know, this is a constant thing having to go back up here. So I should probably have better pathing. All right, so we have a fresh bastion to explore. It looks like it hits right about here. Hopefully nobody's mad at me. I know there's gonna be brutes in here, so that's definitely gonna be bad. It's gonna be bad for my health. I've been doing pretty good at taking them out. I've actually kind of got a method. I've just been like sorting them and it's been, it's been actually working out decent. I hear freaking piglins all over the place. The brute was a mean addition, man. They were, the nether was pretty chill. You know, the new update and stuff was... Oh, there he is. There's my friend. Is he stuck? Please tell me he can't get through here. He can't get through here. Yes, we got him. Yes, we've got him. Frig yeah, dude. That was actually pretty pretty sick maneuvers there. But I am a little bit... I'm hearing bad noises still. I'm a little nervous of grabbing this stuff. I think it seems all right. We seem pretty chill. Okay, are we chilling? They're not. They're not mad, right? No, they're chilling. They're actually chilling. That's that's good. That's a good uh, good sign. So let's look around for a chest here and see what we can find. There's. It's funny how there's like zombies and stuff that spawn into this because it's you know it's still overworld technically. Look at all this. Look at all this crap holy. I'm really just looking for the chest. So if you have any chest for me. That would be lovely. We're going to have some weird uh, conglomeration of the two bastions here. It might, might cause some some weird stuff. It's headed my way up. Oh, there he is. There he is. Hello there, friend. Where did he go? Oh. oh dude, <laughs> what the fudge? Oh, I found the chest. I f there he is. There's my friend. Nope. Nope, please no, please no. 
I need to build up one more. That was a little bit frigged. Look, I, why, how are you hitting me? Why do you have such reach? Oh, there's a Bastion Fragment. I kind of want that. There's another one. These guys drop them every time. That's kind of bonkers. Not going to lie. That got a little rough there, but we survived in the end. We got Nether Fragments. We got Bastion Fragments. We got good stuff. And also over here is a chest. A decent couple chests here. But also these fellers might be angry. So we need to kind of... We need to kind of fill this in and not get butt stuff here. Okay, that's actually... That should be pretty good. Oh, there's more chests right... Is that the chest I've already checked out? I think that might be already explored area. Anybody home? Oh, no. This is a uh, fresh area, it looks like. Smithing template. Um, I don't think... Do I need more smithing templates? Probably not, but... You know what? I'm going to take it. Let's see here. More smithing templates. Uh, magma cream. The gold is good. We could trade that gold. Arrows. Yes, I like arrows. I've been running short on arrows, actually. All right, so no no uh, fragments still. Oh, this is bad. He can get over here, can't he? We don't want you to be able to get over here. We also don't want you to be able to see what I'm doing. So I'm building a wall. It's, um, you know, for my own, my own protection here. You know, I know you're friendly sometimes, but not all the times. Um, Bastion Fragment. Okay, cool. We're kind of gathering a few more of those, but nothing as far as other fragments. Are you going to be, are you guys going to be chilling? Oh, there's a, there's one of the bad ones. Let's hit him. Let's bring him on over into here if we can. Come on. Come over here and be angry, my friend. You can come over here and be angry. Don't be angry over there. Look at, I'm right here, buddy. I'm right here. Come on. Find your way over here. I like how nobody knows where I'm at. Like, it's like I I don't exist to these guys right now. Oh, now, now they're mad. Now they're mad. Of course. All that time, I was trying to get you mad, and you refused to be mad, and now you're mad. Ooh. Oh, no, 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 no. Please, no. All right, you guys need to calm your buns out a little bit. Let's build up. Oh, you frig. You friggin' frig. You startled me. Don't you do that. Don't you be startling me. Okay, we have like a new a new safety zone to build here. I think that should be relatively safe. I don't think anybody can get in here or see what I'm doing here. I think we're good enough. A lot of arrows. That's really good. We're, we're digging the arrows. I'm liking that. Iron, definitely handy. Golden carrots. Yeah, I'm gonna have to... I could probably start eating those. That would be pretty good. Soul speed. Uh, nuggets, sure... We still have no next fragment, no good fragments. But we do have like quite a few chests over here, so this is pretty pretty good. And it's seeming like it's pretty safe at the moment. Uh, no, no brutes gonna come frig me up, right? That would never happen. The brutes would never come frig me up for no reason at all. I don't see anybody around, so I'm just gonna, I'm gonna go for it. I'm gonna risk it. Another bastion fragment, but still... No. Next, uh, you know, like, sit ancient city fragment. What about here? More, <laughs> we keep getting pig step, but we're not getting the freaking ancient city fragment. That's the first time I've picked up, uh, Crying Obsidian, apparently. I'm actually gonna wear these gold, my, I don't want these pants to break, they're netherite it up, so I'm gonna actually swap into gold pants for now. Chest plate's doing good, helmet's doing good. For some reason, it's my freaking pants. It's like they're hitting me in the butt or something. I don't know why they're frigging up my pants so bad. What is wrong with these brutes? Are they literally trying to axe my butt? Freaked up, dude. All right, let's climb on down. There's a lot of, uh, of area to explore down here. So we'll see if we can find any, um, any good fragments. Actually, is that, it seems a little separated. Is that the one that, it's hard to tell now at this point if that's the old one or is that the new one? I think that might be old but I do see a bit more down here yeah I don't know it's this is this is a weird situation we've created here oh no they're not mad are they I'm wearing gold you guys are cool right yeah they're cool they're cool they're not mad that I've been destroying their leaders like crazy this thing seems a little bit frigged up to be honest with you it's a bit of open space down here a lot of baddies though I'm gonna have to do it I'm gonna have to just try and take them all out here if I want to go farther ex exploring, I need to, I think I need to take him out. Oh, no, no, no. 
I can't believe you've done this. I can't believe you've done this. I also can't believe I've survived. Oh, I I survived, but then I didn't. <laughs> that was uh, that was pretty close, though. I did good for a little while. At least we're home now. We can have a little bit of a nap. All right, let's head on back there and see what we can do. The path is definitely much improved. We're, we're making progress here, slowly but surely. Eventually, we'll have it all double wide, and I won't fall off of it anymore from getting distracted. You know, this, uh, this is kind of good getting set back because now I can kind of maybe make my way into new areas a little easier. I was kind of trying originally to dig my staircase back up to where, uh, you know, Y70 or whatever. Um, and so I'll keep doing that and I'll be digging through the bastion. So maybe I'll find some like new area that I haven't really touched yet. I did just see, I do see a brute here. Why is there a brute here? Why are you here? Cause like I had taken all these guys out before, right? Okay, here we go, here we go. Gives me a little bit of an opportunity here. Yeah, I had all the guys in this area, I had taken them out already. So why they're back here now, I'm, I'm a little confused. Got him. Very nice, all right, so uh, yeah, I don't know why they respawned. I don't, they shouldn't be respawning, right? I think maybe like they're just from the new one and they just kind of wandered over into here. I'm getting distracted already. My plan was, like I said, to continue my staircase. And then there's fresh brutes there getting me distracted. And there's this level. Just kind of trying to trying to see what happened here. As far as like the mix of the two uh, the two bastions. Because like I think, I'm pretty sure I had explored all this. I think maybe it got overwritten. I think this is a new area. Oh, I see a chest. Okay, cool. I see another chest. Very nice. Uh, very nice. But we unfortunately did not get any new fragments. A mending gold axe. I'm actually going to take that because my axe is getting a little bit beat at the moment. And then there's a little bit more chest over here. Anybody around? Anybody going to be mad? I don't think they're going to be mad. I think we're good. Curse of Vanishing Shovel. Fantastic. Silk Touch Axe. Uh, I, don't, I don't know if that's handy or not. To be honest with you. What, are you gonna, what do you need to silk touch with an axe? If we're being honest. Oh, fudge. It had to happen. All right, well, anyways, I'm back here now <laughs> after that incident. And I can continue on with the plan like I originally said. Uh, before I got sidetracked again and again and again. I can just keep digging my pathway up here. And I'm going to I'm gonna also improve it. I'm not going to have a head hitter. I hate having the freaking head hitter. But yet I always dig a head hitter just because I'm lazy. Hey, hey, I've reached uh, my original staircase, actually. That's kind of cool. Oh, here's my uh, my original platform, actually. So this one kind of goes up a bit a decent ways. This is the original Bastion. Oh, see, so we got, like, we got new Brute Spawns, which is very weird. Why do we have new Brute Spawns on the old Bastion? That doesn't make much sense to me. All right, let's try and, like, get their attention here. Oh, we got, we got some attention. Yes, we did. Oh, no, that's not good. He's going to shoot me. We got to get that. Okay, good. We got that guy out of there. So if we got new brute spawns, I'm kind of wondering, are we going to have new new chest items? Oh, can't get too close. Do you hear that? Oh, my God. There must be a massive amount. Why was it doing that? Was that just... I thought maybe, like, in this hole here, there was just a massive amount of... Oh, there is. There's a there's a decent amount. Not a massive amount, though. I was expecting there to be a lot more for what that sounded like. That sounded god-awful. Okay, we do have fresh items here. Unbreaking three crossbow. Might take that. Kind of cool. Could be handy, right? Ancient debris. Honestly, I'm going to pass on the ancient debris. I have plenty of friggin' netherite. I'm just getting tons of netherite from the grave fragments. So, like, it's not even... It's honestly not even necessary. Just a plain diamond shovel, that's actually kind of handy. But still not the thing that I'm looking for. What in the name of butts is happening here? We getting shoosted at. Do not be shoosting. Uh, I already checked this one. I don't need three pig steps. I think one is good enough. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna make a jump for it. We're gonna see if there's anything good over here. And then I think, oh. Oh, that was nearly my death. 
And it might still be my death. There's zombies. There is baby zombies. I hate the baby zombies. Frig off. Why was he running away? Oh, this has gone. This has gone poorly. Oh, I'm on zombie level. I don't even see any chests down here. Why is there no chest down here? This is weird. There should definitely be not skeletons. Um, there should definitely be chests down here. Was that a brute that dropped in? I'm hoping not. No, we're good. We're chilling. They're just normal ones. Do you have any chests? Do you have any good loot for me? There's a brute. Try and take on the brute, maybe. And of course he's got his buddies. Why do they always have to have buddies with them? Does he have a path? Oh, there's a chest over there. That is good. That is awfully good. I'm going to carefully make a maneuver here. Very nice. Come on. Come on over. Yep, we've done it. We've freaking done it again. I'm getting to be a brute professional. I used to, like, really struggle. If you look back to my first Minecraft series, it was when they first introduced the brutes, actually. Yeah, it was because uh, it was the Caves and Cliff update and then the Nether update, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, I'm, the, the timing on that, I'm, I'm not really remembering exactly. It was kind of when they were doing their updates a little weird, I think. I think they're doing better with their updates now. But, anyways, that's not the point. Uh, it was like when they first brought the Brutes in, I didn't even know about them. Going into a Bastion and getting completely frigged up. I already checked that one, right? Yeah, I did. Yes, I did. Alrighty, well, I don't know. We're not getting any good fragments out of this, it seems. So, I mean, I do have eight more of them. I can throw more and keep trying in these uh, Bastions. And maybe eventually I'll get something. I could. I, that's honestly that's something I can do off camera. Let me know in the comments if you think uh, maybe off camera grindage on Bastion fragments. But um, I also have Fortress fragment, so I'm gonna try that also. Well, I'm gonna have to rebuild my staircase. It looks like my staircase got a little bit frigged up over here. Uh, so let's go ahead and not get knocked off into the void by a magma cream. That would have been bad. I freaking hate mag. That is the worst biome that exists. Is the one that spawns massive amounts of freaking magma cream, and it's it's all lava and magma creams, and it's freaking horrible. And of course, like whenever you're you're um, whenever you make your first Nether portal, you always freaking end up in one of those biomes. Like I, I've said it before, but I, like the the Nether update was pretty cool with adding the new biomes and stuff, like. It's pretty sick having trees and new animals like the um, the hoglins having the piglin trading like all that stuff is pretty cool but then at the same time it's like holy frig did we need to have biomes of death like the soul sand valley and I think it's called the basalt delta something like that did we really need that holy crap look at all the spawnage that's going on over here ridiculous how would we ever go about getting like a wither skeleton or blaze? Cause like everything just spawns here. Every other regular mob. So like how would we get the stuff that we actually want ever? Uh, I think what I might do just like this way, let's just go ahead and throw that next fragment. I like just throw it out there. Please don't be wasted. Oh, it worked, it worked, it freaking worked. I am very glad. I'm gonna try and like get a staircase going here if I can. Oh, we're going in. And there's lots of spawnage already. There's that's just how it's gonna be here, I think. Lots of spawnage. Bonkers amounts of spawnage. Oh, you can frig right off, Mr. Zombie. You're not even supposed to be here. If this was the nether, you wouldn't even be here. Why are you here? I suppose while I'm in here, I don't need to wear the gold armor, right? I could probably just go in a little bit more protected because things are going to be a bit uh, dangerous here, you know, so might want to might want to wear the netherite. There you go. That's what you get. It seems so friggin weird to see just all these regular mobs in here. And there we have a blaze spawner with no blazes. Oh, there's blazes now. Let's uh, let's try this out. Let's see if we get anything different from this. I'm assuming probably not just regular blazes, you know, so. I don't think we're gonna get anything crazy different, but it's worth a try, right? 
I gotta throw those out, but it's gonna cause it's gonna cause havoc, of course. Blaze rods, yep. Uh, just regular old blaze rods. Let me get rid of those boots because they're a little bit beat. There we go. We've cleared up the inventory a bit, and it's now daylight, so we're kind of a little bit safer. Just gotta look around for some chests here, and hope for the best, I suppose. You know, hopefully we're gonna. What is that? Oh, no, it's just an arrow. Okay, hopefully we're gonna end up with that next fragment that we need. I don't have high hopes here. After the last uh, fortress, you know, we didn't really get much good. I, I'm not sure that this one's gonna be any different. So if that's the case, uh, yeah, I'm not sure. Not sure what we're gonna do. You guys can always leave me suggestions or things that you know work or may think work. Uh, definitely drop some comments down below. That will help me out a bunch. Now we got a weird intersecting uh, <laughs> fortress here. Now what I don't know is like, it, what's what's old and what's new here now at this point? I might have made a mistake by throwing it too close here. Yeah, see, because now it's like, I don't know, is this part of the old one? Is this part of the new one? And is that part of the old one? Is that part of the new one? Um, I just don't know. Oh, I see a chest though. That is a good sign. And I think it's one that I've already checked out. I think this is part of the old old fortress. Yep, we have explosions and a torch, so that's definitely old fortress. And we have creepers and skeletons. Old fortress. That's what that means. So that chest is likely already explored, but we're going to check it anyway. Yep, already emptied. Frig off, frig off. All right, I'm bailing out of here. Now this, I think, is new. I'm not. I'm not really sure. Actually, this is weird. Like I said, I really kind of fudged up the generation here with. Uh... Yeah, no, this is old. This is where I was just at. Frig off, zombie. I don't, I'm not sure what's going on over here. Let's let's check this out. I have been here. There's torches. Okay, so this is just part of the old still. Is this part of the new? I, I just I really fudged it up. I can't tell what's old and what's new lava here I think this is still old. Yeah, this is old I think basically all the upper part here is old and the lower part is new so Here's my staircase. So this fortress doesn't seem to have like interior areas where you're gonna get chests and stuff That's kind of what it's looking like. So kind of a bit of a useless fortress I think if we don't if we don't have an area where it goes down where we can like actually get chests, then I think that we're pretty much butt up here. No thanks, pal. Not on my worst day. Yeah, so though it would appear as though we've um, created the useless fortress. <laughs> Basically, uh, there's no interior, there's no place to get chests, it looks like. Not like the, the last one. The last one was a bit better. It has, it has the uh, blaze spawners, but that's not really super useful because I have enough blaze rods. I'm not getting anything new from that. So yeah, I'm, I'm a little bit at a point where I'm stuck now. I could keep throwing, like I said, I can keep throwing bastion fragments. Let me know, drop me a comment if that's something you think I should maybe try off camera, just try grinding that. And maybe that will turn into something where I get a uh, ancient city fragment. Because really, that's that's all we need at this point in the game, is we need to get the Ancient City Fragment. Alright, so what I'm going to do here, I'm going to throw one more Bastion Fragment. And uh, I'll explore this off camera and see what we get out of it. Oh boy, that's fun. That's a good spot to be. I'm bailing. Ooh, this looks like a good Bastion. It had a big gold thing there. So, uh, yeah, anyways, I have one more that I'm going to explore. I'll do that off camera. And uh, we'll see if I end up finding anything. And uh, if not, like I said, drop me comments and let me know what you guys think the next maneuver should be. Uh, because as for right now, I'm a little bit stuck on how to progress. But uh, anyways, guys, that does it for today. So hopefully you enjoyed. If you did, hit that like button down below. Subscribe to the channel and turn on notifications. So that way you're not going to miss out on any future streams or videos. Join the Discord if you want to come by and chat. And if you want to help support the channel here on YouTube, it's only 99 cents to become a member, and that gets you a bunch of cool perks. Access to that 24-7 cross-platform vanilla Minecraft server videos a bit early. Emojis you can use in chat and stuff like that. Another good way to support, if you want, check out some uh, merch. Link is in description and on the channel. You can uh, check that out. There's a lot of cool shirts, hats, 
stuff like that. Some new sleeveless for the summer. I'm waiting to get those uh, in the mail. But anyways, guys, thanks again for watching. Hopefully I will see you in the next one. Peace.